Three luxury model homes went up in flames and two others sustained damage in an apparent eco-attack. Firefighters found explosive devices inside the Seattle area homes and a spray-painted sign with the initials of a radical environmental group was found near the scene. The sign mocked the builders' claims that the 4,000 plus square foot houses were environmentally friendly. We are investigating this as a domestic terrorism incident. Uh, we're going to investigate it as such until we learn otherwise. It's estimated that Monday's pre-dawn fires caused $7 million in damage. Gray Lundberg lost his dream home. Ironically, this house uh, just won a national award for uh, its best one-of-a-kind custom home for the National Association of Home Builders, both for its green aspects and its, its quality. Critics of the development feared the homes could pollute a nearby creek that's home to endangered Chinook salmon, and opponents questioned whether enough was done to protect nearby wetlands. This woman lives just a half mile from where the fires broke out and calls the incident a tragedy. When the houses were going in, uh, this area didn't really want the homes to go in because of the wetlands. Uh, they were kind of upset about the homes going in, not partially for environmental reasons and also just because of we're septic run out here. A Snohomish County Councilman says he was shocked and vows to catch those responsible. We're going to pursue them with all vigor and uh, if they're trying to send a message, the only message they're sending is that they're sick people and they are criminals. A $100,000 reward is being offered for the arrest and conviction of those responsible for setting the fires. Diane Kepley, The Associated Press.